a beautiful world out there and just don't pass on the dare if you have the will and a moment to spare it's a beautiful world out there it's a beautiful world out there one trip to it in a coconut is our water is hot not that I have a machete to open it but somebody might Nick has bound his feet together with his belt some Houdini trick not really sure about that Survivor. There's your treasure, pirate. Water we had in the sun. Uh huh. It's hard to drink from. <laughs> Today we're going to take Trixie to a vet on Ramrod Key. We found a small tumor like um, bump on her neck, and we're, <clears throat> excuse me, we're going to have that checked out. It's been there for a short while, and it seems to be about the same but it had a scab on it last week. So we're gonna have that checked out and hopefully she's okay and it's not cancerous and we will keep you updated on that. Trixie, why are you here today? Because they found a lump on my neck. You got a man's voice. <laughs> You're being a good girl. We'll take you swimming after this, I promise. You wanna go swimming? I bet you do. Not now. Yeah. Sit down. We're waiting for the doctor, okay? Are you posing? She is. <laughs> I thought that she was like... <laughs> she was being patient. <laughs> That's her trying hard. <laughs> Going to the hair now. There's Chixie's lump. So they took a small sample of her lump and they're gonna look at a microscope make sure to see what the cells look like, see if they're cancerous or non-cancerous. They may have to send out a sample to the lab. And other than that, we will find out here shortly. It's good to have insurance on your pets. We've seen a few comments online about people with pets and how to deal with veterinary care while you're traveling. Well, for us, Trixie has pet insurance, which is accepted nationwide at any veterinary service, which is amazing. So we don't worry about where we take her. We just take her when she needs it. And we send our receipt to the insurance company and they reimburse us for the things that are covered. So if you don't have that and you're on the road, I think it's a really good idea to look into that. The veterinarian didn't see any cancerous cells in Trixie's aspiration, so we had no concern of further testing. He believes this bump to be a benign fibroma. With our minds put at ease, we fulfilled our promise to Trixie to go swimming down at Ramrod Swimming Hole, the locals' favorite sunset spot.
our first week here in Key West and Nick and I both walked into the first place we saw and we're hired on the spot for some new jobs, doing part-time jobs. They're close enough that I've been riding my bike to work in the morning. Super nice that it's so close and we're gonna spend tonight watching a boat show. They're doing Boat Lights Town in Key West. So that's where we're headed now. You want to go to Key West? Yeah? Let's go to Key West. What are we doing in Key West? We are going to uh, watch some boats in a parade, like a little light show, and uh, we're going to go see some live music. We arrived to Mallory Square in Key West just in time to catch the setting sun. A few friends of ours were also in the area, so we hit the streets by foot to meet up with them and head to the Parade of Boat Lights together. On our way to go check out some live music, Nick had to stop and try his luck at Captain Tony's. There's a tradition here. After becoming enlightened at the bar, you stand on the sidewalk out front facing across the street and attempt to toss a quarter over your head and into the Goliath grouper's mouth above. It's said to bring you good luck until you leave the island if you succeed. And if not, you can donate your quarter to a good cause. This guy gets a lot of quarters at the end of the night. Public school, thank you. Public school. You donate 25 cents to a public school. Yeah. <laughs> We ran into a woman named Captain Katie, and she invited us out on her boat this morning. She works for the dive shop here on Luke Key, and they take some tourists out to go snorkeling and boat rides and scuba diving, and she kindly offered to take us out this morning. So we are up early after being out late last night, and we're going on her boat. Trixie is invited, so that's awesome, and I believe it's a four-hour tour. We're gonna go out to a protective reef, snorkel around, Join us next Tuesday as we hop aboard Captain Katie's ship and hit the sea. You won't want to miss this shark-filled adventure. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing so you'll never miss another episode. And we'll see you next Tuesday for another adventure. Interested in joining our travel crew? Head on over to our Patreon page and buy us a mile. All proceeds go towards bringing better content to you.